thing, guys, I got to tell you, you, you must, 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 must shoot for purpose and for profit. Most of us just shoot for JPEGs. What a waste of your time and your talent. What a waste of an incredible story. What a waste of their beauty. Can you imagine having a gorgeous couple like we had, even though it was a, a faux couple, so to speak? What a waste. So now we've got the photographs. You can just send them to your clients and you might say, well, that's what they wanted. Therefore, that's what they gave them. I'll come to that in a moment. Now, I want to talk about the techniques and how easy it is to design an album, possibly even design some wall art and create and understand a system for you to follow. And I want to spoon feed you the information on how to convert your JPEG only weddings and portraits uh, into albums, especially during this time, because the easiest money that you can make is more money from your existing clients because they already trust you. So um, what I basically do, uh, let's cut to the computer here. So right now, um, I use a program called Photo Mechanic. Okay, so Photo Mechanic 6, uh, it's camerabits.com. If you are viewing your photographs in a program like Lightroom or Capture One, it's, it's slow. This is so fast. Like you can, you can double click the shots and you can view your photographs so quickly. Um, now right now, I actually photographed raw and small JPEG just for the sake of the, uh, the, the presentation. But you can basically see how quickly they, those photographs we can, we can look at. So right now, I always upload and view my images in Photo Mechanic, Photo Mechanic from camerabits.com. It's the fastest program out there, the industry standard. Then I can view them very quickly and just have some fun with them. Now traditionally, I would go in and work out what I want, what I don't want. Um, which I could very much do, but I'm thinking, well, actually, you know what? I think I, shall I, shall I, no. Okay, these are all the photographs that I've taken. I'm just letting you know that I've, I'm using a program now to design an album called Fundy Designer. So Fundy Designer. Um, if you go to fundysoftware.com and you will find this, and we're gonna give you some promo codes that you can take advantage of all the partners that we have uh, in terms of everything that you will need to go from literally from from nothing, a blank canvas, to photographing. How do you share them with your clients? How do you design an album? How do you choose the photographs? What happens? We're gonna share with you right now. So what I've done, I simply just added photographs and I've preloaded all these images in. Again, straight from the camera. Of course, you would delete blinks and duplicates. You would do all of that stuff. Right now, I'm going to design um, a Graphi Studio book. So I, one of my partners is Graphi Studio. They're an Italian company. And people have the impression that Graphi Studio being from an Italian made company that it would be incredibly expensive and you'd be surprised on how affordable it is and I'm going to bring some, some more amazing um, things to you later on today. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the album module, click on album and what you'll do is you'll go to Graphi Studio, click on next, we're going to go right down and we're going to create a young book, the young book USA. Now obviously you'll choose what part of the country that you're in. Um, but for a product that I'll be showing you later on today, and uh, basically the program that we've got coming is the Maverick program. What is the Maverick? Who is the Maverick? Who is Maverick? Uh, you will understand it. So if you want to choose a Maverick album, you will actually go to Young Book USA, click on Next, select the book line. Didn't I already do that? I thought I did. While you're, while you're doing um, that, I just have to say thank you again so much to Graffy and especially to Dario who just worked his butt off with you, Jerry. I mean, I have not had anything to do with this and I have been watching you work hours and hours late into the night and for Dario out in Europe late into the night. Um, none of this would have happened without these two amazing men working their butts off while trying to do all of their regular work as well. Uh, and as Jerry explains the program a little more, you're going to see why I feel so grateful because this is a huge game changer. Okay, guys. So right now, thank you for that. Um, yes, it's been, a, it's been a labor of love, but we're very excited because we feel like the industry needs this right now. And I just, we just wanted to give a gift to, to you guys. So let's do this. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to click on this bottom right-hand side and we'll be able to see all the photographs. Now... There's a few ways we can do this. Either we can actually just click on them one by one and, and favorite them with the love heart, or we can view them like this, which is sort of like the way I like to do it. So what I'm gonna do is, if you click on that first photograph, this will come up. And then if you click on the arrows, you'll see how it moves from left to right. 
The cool thing is that if you actually press the up arrow, you'll see that it gets favorited as a, as a heart, like a favorited, like this is what I want. So what I'm going to do now is choose my favorites, and let's see what we end up with. So you can see the big difference between passive look and that little hint of a squint and the eyes. It just looks amazing. So I'm going to untick that, click that, and now next one, love that. That was just a shot that I took as she was playing, so I'm going to get rid of that one. So I just press the right arrow, up arrow, because I want that. I want that. Let me see where we're up to here. Yeah, they're okay. I'm going to move on from those. I'm not. They're okay. I am. I'm going to choose these ones. So up arrow, up arrow favorites them. Okay, up arrow. No, no. And then I'll start with this one. Again, I'm favoriting them. So Fundy, Fundy Software is amazing. Andrew Funderberg is amazing because he listens to photographers. He cares about the industry. He's, uh, along with many of us in the industry, he champions the, the, the printed process and really has helped photographers and really changed the game. So I've got to give a lot of, lot of kudos and respect um, to, to Andrew and his team. OK, let me look at this. OK, so I'm picking two out of these. So think of it like every s spread has to have a certain, certain sensibility. So sometimes if I'm scrolling through and I want to quick compare them, I sort of do it like that. Um, then, yeah, so it depends on which way you'd like to do it. I think I like these ones, actually. So there's an, again, I'm showing you multiple ways of doing this. The handsome Brazilian, boom, boom, love that. Yep, very good. Let me see. <laughs> You're passing by photos that everyone else would be like, yes, yes, that one. <laughs> <laughs> That's like exactly what I do. That's why Jerry calls our weddings, because I go past and I'm like, well, every shutter click of Jerry's is amazing. So <laughs> well, thank you for that. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. And then boom, and then boom, and then boom. All right, fantastic. So we've chosen the photographs that we want. Now we come back here and let's use a filter. Showing 29. Can you, you know what? Yes. I just had a, like, I'm amazing moment. <laughs> oh, wow. OK. All I right. mean, we know you're amazing, no, but no, for no, you no, to no. say you're amazing. No, 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 no. <laughs> I... That, that's pretty, Jerry. So just so you know, like a lot of, I've, I've heard a lot of people who've never met Jerry. Those of you who know Jerry know that he's just a little kid, and he's the humblest, most beautiful man with the biggest heart that you've ever met. But if you haven't met Jerry, you sometimes might think, oh, he might be full of himself. That's furthest from the truth. So that's why I'm like, I'm teasing no, 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 him no. pretty badly about this because he never does this. So my, my goal, <laughs> in, my brain, when I was photographing, I was like, how close can I get to a 30-sided album? Now, I wasn't even counting as I was choosing the photographs. Like, I was trying to sort of be conscious of it when I was shooting. And then as I was doing this, I'm like, holy sh**, 29 of 56. Don't forget the last one's a panorama, which means, um, boom, I nailed it. All right. <laughs> I am so excited right now. You have no idea. You weren't counting as you were shooting? Well, I was trying to, you know, get... I mean, impressive. obviously, I, I eliminated some, some, some scenes, but I thought that was a bit of a duplicate, but I felt, <laughs> I felt whatever. But all right, guys, so watch this closely because it'll, it'll happen and you'll blink and you'll miss it. Okay, so what I've done is I am creating a nine and a half by nine and a half album. Okay. <laughs> magical, magical. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I am designing this album right now, okay? This is a nine and a half by nine and a half Maverick album. You'll understand what that means very shortly. And it's beautiful. I'll come back to this in a moment. So what we're going to do, and I'm... Hopefully I remember how to do this. Okay, so what I've done is I've selected that, that image and I've actually pressed P, shortcut P, okay? 
Now, I'm going to go to auto design. I'm going to pick 30, 30 pages, total images, um, uh, two, sorry, uh, 29. Minimum two per spread, maximum two. Design is an album. I'm going to use the match original. Available is going to be the filtered images because I'm on the love heart right now and I'm actually going to do it according to file name. All right, ready for this. Are you ready for this? Watch this. <laughs> I'm going to count, and when I press the button, we'll see what, how long it takes. Ready? One. Wait. One, two. Oh, it happened in a second. <laughs> All right, guys. So remind everybody, what button did you just push now? I just pressed the auto design, and I pressed design. Now, if your mind <clears throat> was not blown by that, can you just find some other industry to be part of? Because that freaks me out every single time. Watch what happened. Let's come back here. We literally designed a 30-sided album with a click of a button. Let's have a look at the spreads. OK, there's the guides, but let's look at it in all its glory. OK. So sometimes, so basically, as it's designed, actually, one second, let me do this first. Let me, just, let me just make sure it's all fitting beautifully. So just so you know with Fundy, you press G twice, it brings you the guides. Okay, that's looking good, that's looking good. That's looking good. Okay, so I just wanna make sure that that fits. Boom, boom. I said boom, boom, boom. Let me hear you say whale. Whale. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so while you're doing that really quickly, can we see what it would look like with multiple images per side? Now normally when we're, we'd be designing an album, we would do that. In this case though, we are going to be showing you one image per side and we're going to explain why. And there's a very, very important reason. So it's very important that you stay tuned until after Jerry finishes <coughs> designing this album. Um, and it's part of this program that I was telling you about. So there's a very important reason. It's a very good one. All right, guys, so let's look at the album now. Um, oh, one second, why is, has it gone here? Okay, let's look at the album in all its glory. So maybe, um, yeah, perfect. See, Jason, you're, we're, we're, we're like dancing right now. This is like a, this is a perfect thing. This is the first spread. We're opening up, second spread. Do you see how every spread has a different mood, different sensibility? This is laughing, obviously, as a couple, both giggling. Um, I love this. Sometimes what I like to do is grab an image like this. So if I go back, grab an image like this, put the guides on, I go full bleed, well, full bleed, fit it, and then flip it. Oh, no, 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 I don't want that. I want to flip the individual image. Isn't that cool? So you, if you do it once, it looks awesome. If you do it too many times, it loses its flavor a little bit. Now, you can also do it on this case because there's a nice little flipping going on there, which is awesome. He looks really cool there. And again, even that can be flipped, which I think is fun. And then I'd say with this one, would probably just make it a little bit. So you see how the auto design, it's obviously it's just going to choose a design. It can't think like a human. So you've got to basically adjust it as you please. Uh, and see if that's what you prefer. Love that. I love that. Let me do this. And let me fit it. You're doing the gallery, right, baby? Yep. <laughs> that's all right. We'll come back to that. That, and then boom. So, guys, um, let's do this again. Let's see it uninterrupted. Okay, ready? Imagine showing your couples this work. And it could be literally, if it was a portrait session, it could be within, again, 15 minutes. Give them a drink. Have some fun. If, if they've got kids, you can put like a, um, a TV show on or a movie or, you know, whatever it basically may be. But the idea is that we can do something like this in a matter of minutes is insane. Guys, if you're intimidated by this process, this should have just dispelled that very, very quickly. I didn't use... I use one light source. Um, oh, let me just fix that. I use one light source. Um, I use only two lenses. And again, it was a Nikon Z7 II, and then I use a 70 200 for most of it. 
and I basically use the um, 85 millimeter 1.8, which I absolutely love. Um, and that's it, guys. So right now, what would we do to actually order this album? Okay, how 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 will it work? Well, I'll, let me do it in real time. So I go here. Um, pardon me here. Export for print. Okay, so I click on that. I'll just export it. I'm going to choose an album. Maverick 9x5 times 9.5. Create. Boom. So you can basically just do all the spread, which we do. Um, so while that's basically happening, guys, so if you want your logo incorporated into the program, um, into the actual work, just if I were you, I'd probably put it on the last photograph. Like you can basically see that last panorama, that hero shot that I did, that multiple exposure. In that black area, I can just put my a, a beautiful little logo there to sort of start it off. It could be even a little website. Um, but this is it. So right now, it is exporting this particular album to print. Now, obviously, what this would imply is that you would have to retouch it in some way. So again, just to save some time while we're doing this. So as it's exporting, um, what Fundy does have uh, built into the program is uh, a retouching software that's very basic. So let's say, for example, if that you wanted to give your clients a, a sort of a budget option, and you tell them very specifically, I'm not going to go there into every pore of your skin, fix the flyaway hairs and all that kind of stuff, but I can give you a global correction really affordably. Um, you'll actually, I can show it to you here very quickly as it happens. So A, you can do that, okay? Personally, I want something a bit more sophisticated for my clients. Um, and now you might say, well, Jerry, would you do the Photoshop yourself? I go, no, like anyone can do Photoshop. Perhaps not everyone can shoot um, what I did that quickly and that refined, with, which comes with experience. So I'm going to stick to what I do best so I can actually give my work to someone else that to do, so they can do what they do best. So I use a company called Lavalu, for my, especially for my album stuff. So mylavalu.com, M-Y-L-A-V-A-L-U. And we've got an incredible discount that they're offering, which I'll actually sh share with you very shortly. Um, and it's amazing. How liberating is it that obviously before I would have exported to print, right? So right now all of these are the images. Quite simply, you can go down here. So you can go to um, images. I could export images for retouching, but I've already got them there. It's pretty obvious. But if you had 500 shots, but you wanted to export the ones that you actually imported, export them. Put them in a folder. Boom. Export the filtered ones, which is what, what, I, what I would recommend. Also, I can export a list of images in use, and then you could just grab the raw file and do it accordingly. Now, what you would do is you would retouch the photographs. Then you would simply come back here, and then you would resync images. So now, they, they have to be named the same way, by the way. If you get a file and then you rename it after you've retouched it, it's going to screw everything up. So this list would go to Lavalu. They would retouch them and then they're going to work them. That takes about five days, ridiculous. Then they're going to FTP them back. Then I resync them, boom, the program Fundy software will resync, and then I would have done that export thing that I basically just did. The cool thing now is that I've got an album ready to upload, and I don't have to touch it after that. It's absolutely done. So just a very quick thing. If you wanted to um, produce like wall art, you can do that as well. So we go here, Graphy Studio, next. Wall art, finish. It's basically going to create a little section um, in the program where I can actually add to the wall art if I wanted to. So let me do that. So now I'll find the design that I want. So I've, had, I've got some collections sort of already preloaded here. I simply find the one that I want. The cool thing is that you can import a photograph of your li the living room of your clients, ask them to stick a piece of paper um, of uh, a letter-sized piece of paper in that environment, then you can show exactly um, what the actual size would be to scale. So right now I've got 40 by 40, 19 and a half by 19 and a half. I just press S for that. And then now I can show you, I mean, I've got like probably five or six collections I can do right now. Um, but what I'm thinking here is... <laughs> Where's the pain? Where's the struggle? You can be done before the client even gets home. <laughs> yes. Well, that's the whole idea. So, again, I'm not going to go too far into this. 
But I like the idea of this one, this one, this one, bam. You can basically show your clients what it would look like exactly in their home environment. Guys, if you are not doing this, damn it, do it. You are going to sell more. You're going to survive this pandemic and you are going to thrive beyond it. For those of you already fans of Fundy Software and Graphy Studio, um, you're, you're thinking this is old school, you know, this has been done, but ha I'm telling you, most of our audience are probably freaking out around about now. All right, there is wall art, there is an album. Now we basically have no excuse. So what basically happens now? Let's do this. All right, guys, I want to introduce you now to the program that we've been, uh, that we've been excited about and we've been talking about, um, and this is it. So... Let me show you. Guys, so I want to introduce you to you um, the Maverick program. It's, we call it a system. Why do you want to be a Maverick? You want to be a Maverick because you want to sell. Now, here's the thing. I don't care which album supply that you use. There is unlimited options. You don't know where to start. What size do you offer? How many, what colors do you offer? Where do I begin? Now, I love Graphy Studio, but their, their unlimited selection to customize any option is a blessing and a curse. They're amazing because they can do anything. The curse is they can do anything, which means where do you begin? So I thought to myself, how do we create a system, and speaking to Dario, how do we create a system to customize it, make it, the selection easy for you as a photographer to pitch to your clients and easy for the clients to adopt? So this program, you could actually adopt this program from the beginning of a relationship with a client, or you may, in fact, what I would do if I were you, go back and look at all of your clients and look at the ones that you photographed their wedding and portrait where you only gave JPEGs. They're not going to be inspired to sit down and look at a complex design. It's going to be an issue, okay? It's going to be an issue. It's going to be a problem. I wouldn't do it. What you'd need to do is give them an easy way to order the photographs, an easy option to look at, and don't make it complicated. Complication of price list is the, is the death of sales. So how cool is this? Okay, all right. So basically, we've given you two size options. You simply go to this order form. For those of you who are already familiar with Graphy Studio, I'm not going to even take you into this store because sometimes, I don't know about you, I'm, I don't know what page I'm ordering, thick, thin, luster, metallic, which size, I might get it wrong. This is foolproof. Watch this. You simply go here and say, I want a nine and a half by nine and a half or a 12 by 12. Now, the, two, the album that's open right there now, that's a 12 by 12, and this is a nine and a half by nine and a half inch. Guys, I am strongly encouraging that you only, you're going to share a gallery with your clients um, for your wedding clients uh, and portrait for that matter. And I wouldn't give this advice if you were actually starting a business from scratch and you sold prints from the beginning. This is really, this system is very much tailored to converting your JPEG on your weddings and portraits into printed products. So if you look at this, a client doesn't even have to approve the design because it's a single image per page. There is nothing to approve. All you get you to do is ask your clients, pick your favorite 30, 50, or 70 photographs, and that's it. So how easy is that? So. What we've also done is that when you adopt this system, I have literally spent the entire week uh, and lots of time months ago as well actually creating the verbiage. How do you reach out to a client? How, what do you say? How do you handle objections? And we're going to cover some of those today. So if you look at this, you simply pick 30, 50 or 70. In our case, we designed um, a 9.5 by 9.5. We picked 30. I like black. So how cool is this? Then we basically um, put the names and date, Belmiro and Montana. And today's date is the 10th, so 02, uh, one there, and then 21. And then you pick a script, so I'm happy with that script, no problem. Don't forget, there's also, you can add parent copies. Now guys, what I want you to understand here is you've got to look at the price. It's 250 bucks. Now, I want, to, I want to be honest with you here, and the guys will probably freak out at me saying this, but I begged Graphy, I said, Graphy, our industry needs a, a really, really good discount, and we need free drop shipping. So here's the cool thing. 
you've just got to press a couple of buttons as I've just done. You check out, you pay. Uh, basically, a, uh, a, a window will come up and you just drag your prints. So in my case, I would just grab my prints that I've got here. So as you can see, this is the exported album, right? I would simply pay that 250 bucks. I would grab this to the folder, FTP it, obviously nominate the address where you want it sent, and guess what? Within about two weeks, the couple will get it. There is no excuse um, not to offer an album anymore. Um, we're very proud of this. And don't forget that quite simply, you need to offer it to sell it. Um, it's only cost you 250 as in the cost of goods for your album. I'm gonna share with you the idea of what like Lavalu would charge for this system, or you might decide to do it yourself. But I love the fact that it's just as easy as click, 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 type it in. You want a parent album, and then you select it, and then you check out. All right, guys, so check this out. So let's go to the uh, nice close-up of me so we can see this all beautiful and juicy. All right, so this is, if for those of you familiar with the graphy line, this is a glorified young book bottom. Okay, beautiful. You've got three choices of colors, okay? Um, and you've got a beautiful ribbon here. Now, the cool thing is that the album fits obviously perfectly inside it, as you can see. And, and guess what I negotiated on your behalf? Free overprinting. So this is free, beautiful, very sexy and stylish. Okay, it's all that, like that liquid varnish. Um, so that's going to be there. And then we have a lid also with that liquid sort of spot UV overprinting. And then it magnets on, which I just think is really cool. So check that out. Can you imagine 250 bucks? Even if you charge 500 bucks and you made 250, I don't recommend that, but even if you did, there is no excuse depending on what you do um, in terms of what your market is. This is beautiful, stylish, a consider high-end bride or perhaps one that's on a bit of a budget. But guys, you need to offer this, it's crazy. All right, let's go back to the program now. So let me remind you guys that you've got a choice of three colors, you've got a choice of two sizes, you've got a choice of 30, 50 or 70, uh, and then you've got your overprinting as well. Now, guys, can, can you customize things? No. Guys, you have to understand that if you want something customized, then obviously you're going to pay for that luxury. So at the end of the day, for those of you in America, you can go in and out Burger, and you've got three choices, or you go to the Cheesecake Factory, and you don't know what to order. Simplify your offerings, and I'm telling you now, like I said, the, the most important thing you have to understand is that when you reach out to clients in a certain way, there are going to be objections for a lot of people, and I'm going to teach you how to do those right now. But you also have to understand that you just have to offer it. Don't be shy. So let's go through this now. Let's go through the um, how to convert your JPEG-only weddings and portraits into printed products. So we want you to be a maverick. So why your clients didn't get an album in the first place? Well, you only offered them JPEGs. My suggestion is, let's say, for example, that you started at $2,000, right? You, you're a, you, your collections were two grand, that included a coverage, and that included no printed product, just the files. I would say to you that if you were to offer a printed product inclusive in the price, don't you think that at two and a half grand, three grand, or whatever it is that you would charge, that your perceived value is so much higher because you've got something physical, a legacy for your clients, of course. So they wanted to do the album themselves. Let's face it, any client that says, I want to do the album myself, and you've given the files to, you know they haven't touched the files. You know they don't know what to do. Most of them don't have Photoshop. Yes, they can print them at Costco and crap like that, but come on, we are not Costco photographers. That's offensive, right? We should be championing the cause of print. We should get out there and offer it to them. So, and just basically, we just know, even ourselves as photographers, we, many of us don't print our own work. You have to know that if someone said that they're gonna use the JPEGs to print their own album, 99.9% .9 of the time, they wouldn't have done it. They can't afford it. Guys, that, dare I say, it, is bullshit because the same bride who said that they can't afford it spent more money on a cake than you. They spent more money on their Louboutin shoes than you. They spent more money on a candelabra and chair covers than you. You have to know that doesn't matter. People can't afford it and all of a sudden Labor Day weekend comes along and all of a sudden everyone's got money for everything. So just know that's the, that's the case. Also, you might say, well, Jerry, I don't like to sell. It was on my price list. They only chose the JPEGs. I don't like to be sold to. Guys, you are sold to every day of your life. You go to a, a factory to buy a bed. You don't begrudge 
the, the furniture place because you're there to buy a bed, but they've got bedside tables, bedside mirrors, pillows, pillowcases, mattress protectors. How dare they, those bastards, offering everything, and how dare they, or how dare that restaurant offer me a cocktail? All I wanted was a steak. Guys, the worst they can say is no. The difference is we're not offering a steak that goes in one and comes out the other. We are, <laughs> we are creating something that is going to outlive us all. Think about that. We are creating a product that will outlive you and me and the client. So um, also, you might say, well, I don't really find the value in it personally. I'm not that kind of emotional person. And my answer to that is, since when did the Ferrari salesman drive home in a Ferrari? Stew on that one. That's an awesome one. They, and then someone may have just said, I, don't, I just don't want an album. I just don't want one. Just give me the JPEGs. Until somebody dies. Until you, grandma wants a photograph and she doesn't understand Instagram or anything like that. Guys, you cannot beat the physical experience, the tangible, touchy-feely experience. If you're talking about love languages, a lot of love languages of people are touch and you're removing that. And I'm, we're not talking about thumbing away a photograph on Instagram or Facebook. That's not touch. Touch is to be able to... To, to touch and feel and turn the page and tell the stories of all the things that we're doing. And last but not least, the process of designing an album and what to do and how to do it and when to do it and how to pitch it to the client, you might like, well, that's just all too difficult. I might as well just make a thousand bucks and shoot a wedding and be done. Guys, the easiest money that you can make is more money from your existing clients because they already trust you. So you must offer them an album and get out of your way because I've just shown you that we shot for 50 minutes, we shot a 30-sided album and we put it together. We could do, literally, we can FTP these shots to Lavalu very quickly, very affordably, get them back and get this done within a few weeks. Why wouldn't you do it? You'd need to go back and find your older clients and convert them. Okay, so here's what you'll need, guys. I want you to look at this. Now, this is going to be spoon-fed to you. Of course, if you miss everything, you can just go back in there, and that's okay. Um, maybe, perhaps, uh, take the cam my camera away there, Jason, just the computer only. Okay, so what you'll need. Okay, first of all, create your Graphy uh, Studio account if you're not already an existing client. That's a very, very simple thing. So um, Dario and or Maureen will put a link on how to do that, a link to do that. Then, here's the cool thing, guys, that apart from just telling you and explaining to you what's going on, I will, once you become a client, um, we're working on an information pack. This will be available in the next couple of days where we will spoon feed you the promotions that you give to your client. How do you ring them? How do you email them? How do you handle objections? All of that. So that's going to happen. Then, of course, you reach out your to your clients like your life depended on it. Of course, your life depends on it, guys. It, it is that urgent right now. Many of us we are struggling. There's no weddings or very few weddings in our areas. We must get out there and spend our time marketing. Don't do your own Photoshop. You're wasting your time. You need to convert your existing clients with, that you've only photographed for JPEGs and so on into printed products. If you're actually starting afresh, when you're new to the industry, you should be developing a campaign that is so, how do I say, printed products should be just standard right away. Obviously, create the gallery for them to choose their phot photographs. So I'm going to show you how easy that is. Then retouch the photographs, then design and export the album ready to print. I just showed you how easy that was. And then, of course, order the album as I showed you those buttons to, to click, and then you can drop ship it to the client. So, guys, here's an opportunity. The opportunity that we have in this industry right now, the, w mankind has been reset. We have been reminded of what's most important, time and health. There's nothing else more important. Even before health is time, because without time you have nothing, and of course you need health uh, to go with it. Now, I got sick. I was very close to the ultimate about a year ago, and I'm telling you, uh, it, it, it's tough. Many of you have lost uh, family, lost friends. We, we all know people that we've lost. It's an incredibly tough time to be a photographer right now. But I've got to say, let's look at the silver lining. Mankind has really understood what's most important and therefore, as an industry, even though that we were somewhat struggling before the pandemic, this is an opportunity for all of us to get together and repopularize the power of print. So this is the promotion that you should be doing. If you want to, screen grab this. In these challenging times, we are reminded that the health, safety, and the strength of our bond with our family and friends and the quality time we spend with them is the most valuable thing in life. What better way to celebrate these relationships than a beautiful and meaningful album? Guys, 
This is the kind of stuff that we're going to basically be showing you in the information pack, the kind of verbiage that you should use. Put it in your own language. Make sure that it feels good to you. It's not salesy. salesy. What you're doing is you are giving an opportunity to a family member, a someone, you're giving an opportunity for someone to really work out how much they value their family. Do they want to create a legacy for their family or not? It's as simple as that. So, so let's say, for example, you're saying, Jerry, I'm with you 100%. You've photographed a wedding or portrait. There's digital files only. And now, obviously, in the information pack, you'll, we'll teach you how to reach out to them. And then now, they need an easy way of choosing the photographs. They probably, the, the, honeymoon, the honeymoon is over, metaphorically, literally. The wedding may have been two, three years ago. And they're not as excited about it anymore. But they probably are not going to want to invest three, four hours going through a complex design which photograph goes where and everything like that. That is very fruitful if you condition your client from the beginning and with printed product already in your collections, that's very fruitful. But right now, you need an easy way to offer and an easy way for them to order. So the next thing you will do is you'll put it, your photographs in a gallery. Now, most of you probably already have a gallery uh, already set up for your clients. That doesn't matter what you use. For those of you who don't know what to do, this is the program that we use a software company. It's called CloudSpot. So cloudspot.io. So basically what you do is you develop a gallery, okay? And you simply just get them to choose their favorite photographs and then they can alert the photographer. It's a, such an easy program. And the best compliment that I can give CloudSpot is if they, if Apple, Apple Mac Apple, was to design a gallery software, it would be this one. It's really cool. Now guys, here's a promotion. There's no promo code needed at the moment because they're doing basically a program $3 a month for three months and then X amount of, of dollars per month thereafter. So as you can basically see in the middle, the starter one, you've got 200 gig worth of storage uh, or you've got unlimited for, for like 40 bucks. So quite simply, for $9 for three months, you will have this incredible gallery software solution and then, like I said, it will go to either $25 a month or $40 a month, which is pretty amazing. Let me show you the gallery that we already created right now. So let me just share my screen. All right, guys. So what you're seeing right now is the gallery that Melissa created while I was talking. So check this out. Look how clean this is. Look how beautiful this is. Um, this is the desktop solution. So you press open. Um, all the photographs show up here. You can have them in rows, columns, bigger gap between them, all that kind of stuff. But look how clean and beautiful that is. Now, once you click on it, you'll basically see where you can favorite them. You can do a slideshow. You can share the image to social media. You can even put prints for sale, so you can put your pricing in there. All you simply do is you press favorite. Jerry. Oh. Boom, boom. All right, guys, so here's what we do. So let's assume that I've favorited 30 photographs. Like, because basically what you're doing, guys, please don't deviate from this program. If you deviate, just go custom. But this program, you're asking the client to pick their favorite 30, 50, or 70 photographs. You will charge accordingly. Now, what they do is they simply favorite their photographs. So obviously, if I did 30, they would all be up here. Then you alert the photographer. Now, you get a list of what you need, send them to a company like Lavalu, get them retouched, you'll get them back, you'll sync it up to Fundy and you're done. It's crazy awesome. All right, so now, check this out. CloudSpot has an app feature. It sort of emulates an app. It's not actually an app per se, but I don't have time to hook this up and I don't want to screw this up, but okay, that's, that's my home screen there. You can, you can add uh, watermarks so p clients don't uh, screenshot those photos. Yes, you can add watermarks in CloudSpot. CloudSpot has a ton of great features, so definitely make sure you go check them out. Okay, so check that out. Isn't that cool? So it very much looks and feels like an app. They can favorite it right there if you wish. Um, it just works out to be just this crazy awesome way of doing things. So really, really fun. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so let's keep on going here, guys. We're going we're gonna to complete the system here by showing you the other pieces of the puzzle. So like I said, first you have to actually 
have an easy way to share it. Now, guys, you don't have to use every piece of the puzzle that I'm telling you. I'm saying this is what, whom I use, this is who I trust, and if you're looking for a turnkey solution, these are the examples that I'm giving you. So, next comes this. You have to retouch the photographs. And the misnomer is that retouching is extremely expensive, and it doesn't have to be. Now, like I said, you might say, well, Jerry, it's free. I can do it myself. No, it's not free. You're paying with your time. What is the most important thing in life, we said, is time. So, like, check this out. This is an example of a basic retouch. So what I did with Lavalu, I said, Lavalu, give me a price on 30, 50, or 70 photographs and give me two levels of retouching, basic and then enhanced. Now, what does basic retouching mean? It means colour correction, exposure adjustment, teeth whitening, skin retouching, including eyes and then, you know, sockets in the eyes, minor flyaway hairs, facial lighting enhancements on people only. If you want something a little bit fuller, like for example, the shoot I did today, I would do basic retouching. This, I mean, this skin's nice, but they had a few flaws, and like we all do. The minute you go a little bit further out, three quarter or full length, and you want to do things like localised dodging and burning, you want to liquefy, like nudge and nip and tuck, and remove distracting elements, a cigarette butt, enhance the sky, well, that's when you go full retouching. Now, it's one or the other. It's basically you do the basic, or you do the full, you can't chop and change. Otherwise, see, here's the thing. For all of these companies to give us discounts that we can actually on give the discounts to our clients, it needs to be formulaic. So that's why it's one or the other. Let me show you as an example of what these costs are. So retouching, for example, 30 photographs, 50 or 70, you can see the difference between basic and full retouching. And... Uh, from memory, I think it was 10% off is basically what, roughly what it was. So like I said, guys, it's like if I was doing 30 photographs um, at 250, I mean, it's just, it's next to nothing, guys. Like, wh why would you do it yourself? $60-odd? So now, now that you've got them retouched, you need, obviously, a, a program like Fundy Software to design your album. Well, boom, we've got 30% off. Use code JerryLive30. Go to Fundy Designer. 30% off with that promo code. Now, what, what am I recommending in terms of the actual, when you buy it? Now, you can, I would recommend the Pro Suite because it gives you the wall art feature as well. So for example, $3.99, and then you basically take 30% off that. Or if you just wanted the album, $2.79, 30% off that. If you couldn't afford it, you can do the Pro Suite um, and do $20 a month, but it actually gives you extra features. So that's my recommendation. All right, well, let's move on. So now that we've got a way of sharing the photographs, we've got a, basically a way of retouching them, then we've got a way of designing the album. Of course, then comes the album. So as we said, the limiting the options in this program is its genius. Don't feel like, oh, I want this, I want that. Guys, get over yourself. If you offer a certain particular range, no one's going to say, well, do you have pink? Do you have yellow? Do you have bigger, smaller, vertical, horizontal? It's very, very rare. If that happens, then you go to your custom, custom album and then you can charge more accordingly. So remember, the couple are not going to want to do a, a lengthy design session. And the closer you actually promote this to your clients to their wedding or portrait session, the higher likely that you're going to have to actually sell it. Go for it, baby. How did they get access to that Fundy promo code? Oh, to that Fundy promo, sorry. <laughs> Uh, well, that, they just wrote it down yep. or they so re, re it? Jerry Live 30. There it is on your screen one more time. Yep. All righty. So like I said, guys, that, that this, is, this is such an incredible opportunity for the industry. As simple as it looks, you might think, what's so revolutionary about it? Because it's simple. It's easy to actually for me to explain, therefore easy to actually buy from the client. And really think about it. You're going to... There's a three-prong attack. You're going to ring your client first. You're going to offer this, okay? And in the information pack, once you join, in a, in a day or two when we finish all of this, but basically once you register as a, as a Graphy Studio uh, customer, um, then, and then go to this page, the information will be there for you. If you're an existing customer, you'll go in your trade area, find the Maverick option, and then you'll go from there. But basically, a three-prong attack is you're going to call the client first, Verbally, um, if they want to think about it or whatever, 
you follow up with an email regardless whether they approve it or whether they're doing it. You follow up with an email. If they still say no, ask them, would you mind if I call you in about a week and see if you've changed your mind or if there's any questions that I can do to make your decision for you to create a beautiful legacy uh, album for your client. All of that verbiage, verbatim, is going to be in that list and you can copy and paste it with my permission in an email and verbally as a script. And I also count all the actual logical objections in there as well. So really, really important. So there it is, guys. Um, and don't forget, of course, that you know, as you, got, you can choose the actual photographs, uh, the colors that you want, the size that you want, the quantities, and don't forget that there's actually parent options as well. Now, let me do the thinking for you. I'm going to show you what the cost of goods are, at least when it relates to the physical album. So here it is, a nine and a half by nine and a half album. Drop ship to your client, including the leatherette, including overprinting on the lid and the actual um, the book itself. 250 for 30 sides, uh, you've got 310 for 50, 75 respectively. Then I thought I'd go one step further. Let's assume that you're actually going to send it off for retouching to a company like Lavalu, who's my, who does all of my albums. So now we do album, we've got the album cost, we've got the basic retouch, which is what I would do for today's shoot, for example. Your cost of goods are three seventeen fifty. Now, here's my advice. Even if you do your own retouching, you should put a value on it. So why don't you, why don't you equate it with what, for example, someone like Lavalu would do for you? Okay, so again, mylavalu.com. Equate your time. But again, what they, they can spend five minutes working an image and it costs you, two, you know, $2.25. You might be such a perfectionist and spend two hours of photograph and will the couple know any different between what you would do and what maybe someone like Lavalu would do? Hell no. They're not that sophisticated. And nor am I saying Lavalu does a, you know, an average job. They do an incredible job, like with that image that I showed you. I mean, they do my work. Um, so, cost of goods, three seventeen fifty. Now, my advice to you is, now you might say, well, where do I begin? What do I charge? What do I do? Well, my, my, my recommendation, in most businesses, in most cost of goods, we would usually make up about 30% of the retail price. So in other words, 317.50 is about 30%. Um, let's say if you charge 990 for that collection, now you could charge more and you could charge less. 990 for that perceived value of that book that you've got there is insane. You could charge 990 for it. It costs you 317.50. And the process is simple. If you want the full retouching option, you can see that it would actually cost you $3.91 and then more, more respectively. So everything that I'm saying, you can use your own companies. Obviously, you have to use Graphy because it's, it's part of that program. But all the other services, do what you do. But if you trust me and you've worked with me for many, many years, you think, you know what, Jerry's under thinking for me. Let me just do what he does. Then everything will be given to you on a platter, step by step. So let me just reiterate this. What we're talking about here is a program. It's not just a single product. It's not just the album from Graphy. It's not just the retouching from Lavalu. It's not just the design from Bundy or the gallery from CloudSpot. These are all companies that we trust, that we've been working with, and have come together and generously offered these great discounts. So we want you to take advantage of that as well. But we've all come together to create this program for you and the program itself is, is actually the step-by-step -step process that Jerry's talking about right now. When you go to the Graphy Studio trade area, you're gonna be able to download this packet that's gonna explain it all. So that's important to know. Right now, I just want you to listen to Jerry, just soak in what he's saying. You're gonna have access to that step-by-step -step process. When he said, what email do you send out, the phone call, he's gonna tell, you're going to have access to what, what the email should look like, what the phone call, what words you should use on the phone call. Trust me, he's been up until 2 in the morning writing all of this down for you guys. You'll have access to it. It's going to be in the trade area of, at Graphy Studio. Um, and then that will also include the ways to take advantage of these uh, promos, the link to get your images retouched by Lavalu at that special rate, the link for CloudSpot, all of that stuff, it's all going to be in there. So, so. Just soak in what Jerry's saying right now, understand the process, and then you'll have access to go back and just review it again later. Awesome, okay, so check out the page right now. Um, this is the website. Um, basically, 
on the web on the main page, so mylavalu.com, there is actually a link to this area, but it's basic you can see the URL right there, so it's mylavalu.com forward slash maverick. And the cool thing is, again, everyone's made it really easy. Um, you put your client ID, so it'll be Bella Montana, first name, last name, uh, address and details. You pick what you want. Do you want a basic retouch or do you want a full retouch? That's fine. Um, and that's it. It's, it's so simple. Once you pay here, it'll come up with a, a place where you just drop and drag the photographs. It couldn't be any easier. Like I said, today's really today's perspective was about demystifying this process. So uh, make sure that you check that out. Guys, so this is the, this is the Graphy Studio page. Um, and you'll clearly see on here um, the Maverick program. So you'll learn more. And then it comes up with this page. It tells you and understands everything about the process. OK, it swatches the choices that you have. It's very simple, one choice of paper, three color choices, three quantities. Um, and then you click on Create Your Account. If you're not an already existing uh, client, you fill out those details. The team from Graphy will get back to you um, within a day. And then, as we discussed, when you order the album specifically, which we showed you that process how, on how, in fact, easy that was, then you simply do this. You uh, basically pay accordingly. And then it'll come up with a place where you can drop and drag your, your photographs. Um, so I just want to refine in terms of what we're advising you. Technically, you can do anything you want on this spread. There's 30, there's 30 sides, 15 spreads, but if you start now giving your clients a choice as to, you could put multiple photographs. Technically, you can do it. doesn't matter. Uh, quite simply, Graphy Studio will actually print those 30, 30, 50, or 70 sides respectively. But I'm saying to you, you want an easy way. You don't want to have to actually spend several hours with the client and start modifying it, <clears throat> excuse me, and all that kind of stuff. It's just a waste of time. Now, also, you can do vertical and horizontal, and that's why we chose square. Why we chose square is that a vertical and horizontal will always have similar spacing and negative space, and it actually looks good. If we start doing vertical albums and horizontal for this program, it's just silly. But quite simply, if you're already a Graphy Studio client and you do a young book, comparing a 9.5 by 9.5 with 30 sides with overprinting and drop shipping, it's literally about a $150 difference. So guys, take advantage of this. And by the way, this is the launch price. This will not be a permanent price forever, at least for the next month or two or a few months. So take advantage of it. And while we're getting the savings, pass those savings back onto your client or just make more money. Um, but that's why we did that. So here's an example, guys, of a particular offer. So an example. My advice as well is do not offer your clients what level of retouching would you like? I would m more do that verbally. Um, or, or decide that internally to, into your studio. Again, just eliminate one more choice. Basically, just um, this is what you do. If you shot a lot of images and there's lots of um, full length and liquify needed and all that kind of stuff, go the full retouch. If it's simple and close or a portrait, go simple. So for this one, this is an example of an offer. It's a nine and a half by nine and a half album. Uh, 30 retouch images, sides, as in 15 spreads. The regular price. Now, here's the, here's the thing. There's nothing that inspires desirability other than scarcity. Everyone loves a sale, and we always want to save something. So, you could offer a regular price, $17.90, place your order by the end of February, or pick something realistic within your timeline, and save $500. Your sale price is $12.90. Bonus. Now, here's the thing. If you need incentives for the client, you can give them the retouched images optimized for social media, hashtag shitty JPEGs. I'm not saying the high resolution retouched version, but optimized for social media sounds a lot better than low resolution. So retouch images optimized for social media. The extra bonus, a $100 credit for your next wall art order. Every single one of your wall art orders and collections, you, you make way more, you net profit way more than 100, which means that that $100 saving will actually make you money. And you'll give a gift voucher um, to your specific clients as well um, for, for future, future portrait sessions. We've even given you templates within your information pack of a PSD of this particular thing. This is a gift voucher that we give out. And don't print it and then come to me for a free portrait session because I'll know you're cheating. Um, so 
the, on the left, you'll see a beautiful big photograph. On the back, you'll see the gift voucher. And, and that's basically it. But guys, it's been a, it's been a crazy ride. Um, I was, my goal was to finish by 1.15. I said, worst case, 1.30. And here we are. Um, maybe a quick little thought as I transition to something else here, baby. Um, so I really hope you guys have enjoyed that. I know we're going to go back to Jerry in just a minute, but I hope that you guys understand that this is a system that Jerry wanted to put together in a really simple, super simple system, knowing that we're all juggling a million things, especially if you've got kids and they're learning from home and you, you're trying to homeschool at the same time and we're frustrated because we don't have a lot of income coming in. Here's a great way to go back to your previous clients, clients who may not have had products, and get them get some albums in their hands and make it simple and easy and fast and so affordable for you with at, to be able to charge at such great profit margins. This is really a no-brainer, and I truly believe that this will be a game-changer for so many of us who just need to get some income coming in. So please take advantage of this. Make sure you just take the time to digest this. Go get that information packet and just soak it in. And um, just want to say thank you to all of those vendors who were so generous and didn't even hesitate. If you've worked with those vendors before, you know that they are all about our industry and they love our industry just as much as we do. Um, and so thank you for just coming to Photographer's Rescue which because we really need it right now. We, we're kind of hurting. I, Jerry's one of the hardest working people I know, and he has worked so hard over this with Dario over the last weeks, months, and year. And I'm just very grateful and amazed at what they've accomplished, and I'm so proud for them. And I, I, if you guys use this program and it helps, please let us know, because we'll know that all those hours weren't wasted. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, so again, uh, from my personal perspective, Melissa, you've done a great job hosting as always. You bring so much joy and grace to everything that we do, so you're amazing. Jason, I've put incredible amount of pressure on you. He's been, uh, there's like seven or eight devices going on at the moment, which is insane. So uh, he's 10, I don't know, he's saying 10 devices. <laughs> Jason is amazing. Like, if you could see what's been happening behind the scenes, he's amazing. Okay, so, so that's been happening. Um, also, uh, Layla, a makeup artist, um, I work with her very often. She's been amazing. Meg was incredible as well, with beautiful hair. And we're going to be photographing also later on today. So we're going to uh, continue because Montana's here. We're going to have some fun. Um, so Montana and uh, Bill Mirror, you're amazing. They're from TNG Models. So if you like them and you want to hire them for anything, TNG Models, uh, they've been amazing for us as well. CloudSpot. Lava Lou, Fundy Software, Graphy Studio, Maureen and the team, and specifically Dario again, you've championed this, uh, this thing with me. It's been amazing. So my advice to you guys is absorb this. Hope you enjoyed that. We've put a lot into it. Um, everything takes time. Repetition, experience, and practice will be your best teacher. We're living in a difficult time, but just know there's a silver lining. I think we should all band together as an industry. Let's continue to form this incredible renaissance and get ready for the roaring 20s because we're going to come out of this stronger. Um, we're going to want to celebrate. People are going to want to celebrate like they've never celebrated before. This has been a gift to our industry, uh, or eventually it will be. You've just got to hang on. Stay strong. Stay patient. And just remember, there's only one thing more contagious than COVID, and that is empathy. I wish you the best, and we'll see you next time. Please share this. Thank you so much.